Hello friends, welcome back to LMSDaily.com. In today's video, I will show you how you can copy specific activities or resources from a Moodle course into another Moodle course. For example, you might have a specific file which needs to be added to another Moodle course and you would like to import that activity from that Moodle course into another Moodle course without taking a backup of the whole Moodle course. So now let me show you how you can import a specific activity into a course in Moodle. So in order to do that, you need to first go to the destination course where you would like to add the new activity. So let me say that I will go to this course. Now when you are there on the course page, you need to expand this more drop down and go to the course reuse section. Now here you can see this drop down and it has the options to import, backup, restore or copy course or reset the course. For this example, we will keep it to the import only because we would like to import the data from another Moodle course. Down below you will see the total number of courses on your Moodle site and if you have huge number of courses on your Moodle site, you can use this search bar to search for a specific Moodle course. Now for this, this example, I will choose this course and click the continue button here. Now essentially what we are doing here is we are importing the activities or the course content from the source Moodle course into the destination Moodle course. For this specific demo we have to uncheck all the other fields except this include activities and resources. And after unchecking everything else don't click on this jump to final step you need to click on this next button here because we have to select the specific activity yet so click next now here you will see the course activities from the source course on this page you have to select whatever you would like to import now i am unchecking everything else and i am just going to keep this class information and it shows that it is a file resource and I would like to import this to my destination course. So I have just select this in, in the general section and afterwards I will click on this next button here. Now afterwards it will ask you for a confirmation and you need to click on this perform import button. And you are done so you can see the message that import is complete and click continue to return to the course so just click this button and you can see that we have this class information file which is imported from another moodle course kindly note that this file resource was added in the general section in the source course so that is why it is added again in the section 0 of this course also if it is there in any other section or topic then it would have been added under the same section number here so thank you very much for watching this video if you like this video please don't forget to click the subscribe button as well as press the bell icon and if you have any questions about this process please feel free to post them in the comments section below thank you very much for watching